my grandparents and my parents put money together to buy me a PlayStation. But then I wanted a new helmet and we couldn't afford it. So we took the PlayStation back because we had no, the money and we bought the helmet. And then my dad uh, painted the helmet himself. <laughs> then two Christmases later I got a new I got a PlayStation finally. And with the PlayStation came the game as a pack. I had that one game for so long because it, there was so much to do in the game. So I just remember spending a, a lot of time in my room. School, homework, game, bed. <laughs> that was the way of life. This was as close as I could get to driving cars because I was too young at the time. 159 is needed. I mean, this game has come such a long, long way. To see it grow, and see it evolve, the feeling, the feedback you get from the car. Ah. The, the simulation is so advanced that you can really learn about the, the curbings, the, the bumps. Uh, it's very intuitive, it's very uh, responsive. You've got feeling on the brake, you've got a feeling for the downshifts, you've got a feeling for the undulations on the track. It's every single line that I would normally take is exactly the same as it is on the real track, which is the most impressive thing. And I've driven that car actually in real life. This is so awesome, I love it. When I started racing when I was eight, we went to the go-kart track. My dad, he would go on track and he would see, he would see who was the fastest kid, stand on the corner and see where he was braking. And then he would move further along and he said, but Lewis, you need to brake here. So I'd come round and I'd brake, uh, I'd brake really late and every time I went wide, I went off. Um, and I'm thinking, geez, I'm never going to be able to do it. And eventually, I could break there, and then I was faster. So that's how I learned to become the latest of breakers. Monaco is a great circuit for me. Um, Monza is a great circuit for me. Because these are corners where you just break super late, small turn, and get on the power. I wouldn't be the driver I am today without the, the advice that my dad had given me. He worked as hard as he could to make it become a reality, and I supported that by performing. For the players.